All right, the moment of truth. Let's get it on. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to another episode. Today, <laughs> you can't even see it, there it is. I'm wearing the pink tutu. This is the tutu ride. Congratulations Doodle on a motorcycle. You beat the pig. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right guys, in case you don't know the story behind this tutu, a few months back, myself and Doodle on a motorcycle challenged each other to a race to 20,000 subscribers on YouTube and she beat me so my punishment for losing the bet was to ride around sporting this lovely pink tutu and so that's what I'm doing today we got the boys we're keen for a ride we had the live stream last night everyone's a little bit dusty we got Luke the brother-in-law we got Shane and Benno's behind me He's doing a, a few camera shots of the tutu, so we'll show you some different angles so you can enjoy my sexy body. So guys, if you don't know who Doodle on a Motorcycle is, has nothing to do with male genitalia. <laughs> uh, she is a female rider, lives in the States and does moto vlogs and all that sort of stuff. A lot of... Um, a lot of content about beginner riders and like tips and tricks and all that sort of shit so if you haven't checked her out feel free to check her out now because i've already lost she she won she beat me fair and square so i'm a bit of a sore loser so that brings me to my next point doodle do you want to up the ante a little bit do you want to go i'm not going to say double or nothing because i'm already doing this but but do you want to um, say let's race to 30k and then shit's going to get real? I don't know exactly how real, <laughs> but I don't know. Let's talk about it. Guys, let me know in the comments, should we race to 30k and what should the punishment be? Because uh, I want to win this one. I want to win this challenge. I don't want her to beat me again. So I'm thinking if I beat her to 30k, she should dress up like a pig or something like that and ride around on her bike telling everyone that I beat her. And, well, I'm going to leave it up to you guys. So you guys post in the comments below what would be a fitting punishment if I do beat Doodle and what do you reckon I should do in case she beats me again. So hopefully that's not going to happen. But anyway, back to what we're doing. We're just going for a ride. We're getting out. The restriction laws have lifted in Queensland. We're allowed to ride um, 50 k's from home. So obviously we're still keeping our social distance and all that bullshit. But um, yeah, we're just getting out of the house, man. But we had a big night last night. If you didn't catch that live stream, too bad because I've already taken it down. But oh man, we got lit. It was <laughs> it was a fucking big one. I think we're just going to cruise down the beach. We did bring a couple of sneakies, so we'll see you when we get there. Ready? All right, we're just cruising into Balgal Beach, so not sure what the plan is. We'll just find somewhere to pull up for a while, have a bit of a breather, get some fresh ocean air. But I got to tell you, boys, it is a little bit breezy out on this bitch. <laughs> I cut up a good pair of shorts to make myself a pair of Daisy Dukes just for you guys lucky i have no shame mate eh? and when i say no shame i mean like not even a little bit my wife just looked at me and just shook her head anyway she knows what i'm like so it doesn't matter so what are you guys doing for isolation lockdown 2020 fucking what a year eh fuck me not the best start well i suppose we're halfway into it now doggos but yeah, you're still being good, staying home, doing what you're supposed to do. you still got a job who's unemployed like me and Benno. Uh, these guys are still working. So, good on them. 
but we have to drink beers and do live streams for a living it's a fucking tough job guys but you know someone's got to do it and i'll put my hand up for that even though it is actually pretty hard like it takes two or three days to get over doing a live stream the struggle is real but at the time it's a fucking great idea oh i can smell the ocean there it is it's right there take my word for it the beach is just there Fuck, there's a lot of people. This is like the first weekend that you've been allowed to travel uh, just for recreation, 50 kilometers from your house. So <laughs> every man and his dog is out, out and about today. Gonna be getting a few strange looks, wearing a tutu and a pink Dixon on a Harley. Would you just look at it? I've even got a stinging net set up so you can go for a swim. <laughs> the fucking tide's out, look at that. <laughs> oh, you can play in the sand. That's a bit. Oh, HK Monaro. Oh my god. Sex on four wheels. Alright, enough waffling shit. Let's find a spot to have a tinny. Catching a bit of breeze in these little shorts, boys. <laughs> oh dear, not a bad spot for a ten. I'm feeling alright till we stop. Hey. I'm feeling alright till we stop. Yeah. Yeah, it was nice. I was fucking miles away, but I was daydreaming, eh? Got a good, good turnout of bikes here, mate. Three wide glides and a street bob. We got the same pegs, bro. You got good taste. No. All right, let's go down there. Yeah. This is what you're supposed to use X fill bags for, boys and girls. Yee <laughs> yee. <laughs> Benno, suck it up, princess. Oh, fuck yeah. I'll be putting it down and become a straight back here, mate. Nah, you'll be right, mate. You'll be right. All right, we're gonna enjoy a little hydration session down here. 20 minutes later. Oh, all right. Back up time. We swapping bikes, bro, or what? Yeah, mate. We good? Ready. Good. Let's go, bike swap. Showtime. Here we go, on the brother-in-law's bike, it's a 2017 Dyna Wide Glide, apes, I like it, my shoulder doesn't like it, but I like it, so the bro is thinking about doing engine upgrades, so he wanted to um, take my stage 5 tyre shredder kit for a bit of a blat, and see what he reckons, so I'm pretty sure he's going to love it. <laughs> it's hard not to love. He has done a set of cams in this thing. I'm not sure what they are, but it does have cams in it. It's 103. But now he's riding mine, the 110 with the Stage 5, so I'm pretty sure he's going to have a bit of a grin on his face. There we go. I love these bars, man. I love them. Just with my Gumby shoulder from that car crash I was in years ago, I can't hold this position for, for too long, you know, which sucks. Fuck, the suspension is hard as fuck. Man, I love that Legend Air Ride. Oh my God, that's, the difference is out of this world. Hell yeah! Look at him 
testing it the whole way pegs spread eagle <laughs> he's loving it <laughs>